Thursday afternoon, Andrew. I don't think I'm giving away any trade secrets by saying that uh, on a sitting week like this, you're starting to think of maybe a, a light refreshment on your way home. Maybe you'll skip a beer and go for a hard solo this week. All right. There's the segue, isn't it? <laughs> There's the airport lounge, heading back to Sydney, heading home to see my family. I love Thursdays. <laughs> favourite day of the week. But this is my favourite story today. The controversy over so-called... Hard solo. Yes, you're not seeing double, and it's not April Fool's Day. Brewer Asahi has released an alcoholic version of the soft drink, and the Teal Independents aren't happy. North Sydney MP Kylie Tink sp- spoke earlier to our reporter and producer Cameron Redden. As it currently exists, the way it's packaged, the way it's tastes, the name of it, it just doesn't pass that pub test. So I'd like to see it taken off the shelves and I'd like to see a conversation ongoing around what sort of products are actually introduced to the market. Presumably she thinks it'll encourage kids to drink. How many kids these days drink solo? That's an interesting question for you. Light on the fizz so you can slam it down fast, maybe with a hard solo? I just had to show this famous 1980s ad that made the non-alcoholic variety of the drink famous. You gotta work it hard to be a solo man. You gonna take the lead and make the others follow. You gonna keep in shape to be a solo man. And when you got a thirst for it, you gotta crack a solo. Extra tangy lemon solo. Light on the fizz so you can slam it down fast. You face the challenge. You've earned the reward. You've got to crack a solo! So the question all the viewers want to know, Tom, is are you a solo man? Liked it back in the day. I reckon I was of the era a few years later when he, he has the solo first and then does that sort of canoe or kayak through the jungle path. I always liked that one. We used to joke, none of it used to go down. Ads, aren't they? It'd go down sort of his whole body. Um, well, at least it was light on the fizz. Yeah. Are they going to send a case to Kylie Tink? Is this the greatest advertising they could hope Yeah, for? it is good advertising. I couldn't resist the story myself. Look, just on that disallowance motion, which I'm sure no one cares about, the government's going to force it on in the Senate. It will get voted down. Everyone will be getting their 60-day dispensing. Bit of a stun if you ask me. I think they'll be talking about hard solo at the kitchen tables tonight, <laughs> not about the disallowance motion in the Senate. All right.